Hey guys, it's your boy Progress and welcome to a brand new video. Today, I wanted to take a second to talk about something that Tory Lanez has decided to get himself into, which I find absolutely insane. But just quickly, for those of you who are unfamiliar with Mr. Lanes, he is actually a rapper that is based out of Toronto, Canada, and is really well known as kind of being originally starting off his career as a bit of a Drake clone, but he's evolved much further than that because now he just clones everybody. His music seems to be very easily liked by many people, although I've never met anybody who could actually name me, like, one of his songs, but still, his music seems very likable because he just jumps onto whatever is trending and whatever sound is popular at the time, so obviously it'll do well. Some might even go as far as to say that he's like a mini-me of rap. Like me. I would go that far. But unfortunately, we're not just here to talk about Tory's music, we are talking about something completely different. Because Tory Lanez landed himself in the news quite recently for a stupid controversy that was just so unnecessary to start. Which is based off of the fact that he decided to hire the Toronto chair girl and used her in his music video for his song Boink Boink? For his song Boink Boink. I can't say that without laughing, I'm sorry. And I don't really expect many of you out there to actually know who the Toronto chair girl is, as I know a lot of my audience is international, uh, so I know you guys will be a little confused as to why this would matter, but don't worry, I'll give you the rundown. Essentially, this moronic piece of silicon named named Marcella Zoya, who's an Instagram influencer, God, I hate saying that, decided it would be the funniest joke of all time, guys, all time, to throw a steel and wooden chair off of the 45th floor of an Airbnb that she was renting out, which made the chair spiral down towards a highway where it actually bounced off of the sidewalk that was next to it, which had been recently traveled by many people. Luckily, in this act of stupidity, she did not actually end up harming anyone, but obviously, with an active highway and an active sidewalk next to it, she very well put a lot of people in danger. Which is why when the video started going viral, she had to turn herself in, basically, and after a long case, she ended up pleading guilty to the act. Obviously, she literally did it on camera and posted it to her Snapchat like a moron, but she ended up being fined $2,000 as well as had to serve 150 hours of community service and two years probation. Which I should add that she is insanely lucky for that sentencing, as the original prosecutors were asking for her to have multiple months of jail time being banned from the use of social media, as well as trying to make her essentially go to therapy for doing these things. Because the entire reason why she actually got off with the easy sentence was because the judge that dealt with this case believed that this girl was truly and utterly just remorseful for her terrible actions. Yeah, right, okay. Now, how Tory Lanez and his song Boink Boink ties into all of this. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't stop laughing. That name is stupid. Why did he call it that? Basically, as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, Chair Girl is seen in the music video as, you know, she at first just seems like everything is very normal. She's doing what probably every girl in a Tory Lanez music video ever has done, dancing around and stuff like that while money's going all over the place from Tory. But like, it ends up taking a worse turn near the end because they decided it would be a funny haha -ha to have the chair girl pick up the chair that Tori was sitting on originally, hold it over her head as if she's gonna throw it at them, and have Tori and the other models cowering in fear and saying, no, 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 put it down. Which, what I'm trying to get at here is that they tried to make a joke out of this really bad thing that she decided to do. Why? Why? Why would you do that? That's stupid. Because, ah, yes, what says remorse better than literally making fun of the very thing that you did. I don't know who on Tori's team approved it or if it was Tori himself, but it's so bad because they clearly used this as like a promotional material thing for Tori's new album because every time, like if you try and play this music video on YouTube, you will have Tori's like little album name and the cover of it 
be flashed over top as a watermark during the time as soon as she lifts the chair over her head. Essentially meaning that if you want to be outraged about this or post on social media about like how ridiculous this is or if somebody wants to write an article about it, they unfortunately have to have Tory Lane's little watermark with his album right there so that it gives him promotion. Which I'm completely fine in participating in that because if Tory Lane's wants to have a watermark over something of him being an utter d then yeah, go for it. I'm sure there'll be like some Tory fanboys in the comments who are like, Oh, Tory Lanez is a troll, you just got baited. But no, like I'm, I'm not concerned about the idea of a rapper trying to get like publicity, but you know, using something that was a genuine bad thing that somebody did and was supposedly remorseful for as a way to promote your music, it's kinda low. It doesn't take someone having the mental capacity over that of a juiced lemon to realize that this is not a good marketing move. It's actually almost getting annoying at this point how people can't just make good music like they have have to have a controversy that's associated with something just to stay relevant. What makes this whole thing even worse as well that why she would agree to do this or why Tori would even ask her to do this in the first place is that as I mentioned, she's still on probation. Meaning that like if the judge were to end up seeing that clip and decided, you know what? No, I was nice before. I'm taking my nice card back. No, this ain't happening anymore. And they just go in hard on them and increase the sentencing based off of proving that she did not learn her lesson, she would be screwed. I wouldn't even put it past not just the judge, but the original prosecutors to come back and say like, look at this, this is proof. We were saying she should have a harder sentence and you're like, oh no, she's learned her lesson. Oh, she's look at, she's a changed woman. No. <laughs> Clearly not. Does that look like the face of a changed woman? Honestly, it doesn't look like the face of a human being, but that's a different story. <laughs> I'm sorry, she looks like Play-Doh, bro. Like, Chair Girl and Tory Lanez are gonna have to start pulling out the vlog camera soon because I, I expect there to be some kind of like, I have made a clear and, and continuous, continuous lapse of my judgment, judgment and I'm and not expecting to be forgiven. I simply want to apologize. But hey, you know what? The one thing that is fantastic news for Tory is that he finally didn't copy Drake this time, guys, because, you know, Drake actually had the decency to remove Chair Girl from the background of his video when all she was was an extra. So in this case, you know what? I guess you could say that Tori fell a little short. <laughs> but in all honesty, like I said, there are clear problems with this. One, it is just so stupid to intentionally try and cause like controversy over like a thing that you're doing with your music. Just go back to promoting music like it's music. Don't promote this thing like you have to, you know, do some crazy act every single time that you want to release a song. Like, why go through this trouble? I don't know, is it just me? Am I crazy for saying that? I feel like I'm insane just bringing up the concept of like, oh, maybe try being a decent person and just making good music. Oh! Mind blown, I know, hire me. But yeah, that basically does cover like all I wanted to talk about today, but I just wanted to showcase this like stupidity in motion because for whatever reason, of, of course, like, you know, media and stuff like did pick this up, but almost everybody in the YouTube space who has a channel who can voice their opinion of saying, no, this isn't cool, has chosen not to do that and instead are just like obsessing over the song, even though I'm gonna just say it, it's literally just like a DaBaby, NLE Choppa, like uh, NA NBA Youngboy, like ripoff song. It's not special. There's nothing interesting about it. The lyrics are boring and the song is just the same as anything else that you can find from any other artist. So I don't get this whole thing of just being like, oh, I have to praise Tory Lanez because, oh, I just need to love him. No, you don't have to do that. You can be your own human being. Please stop promoting this type of stuff. It's not cool. It's not funny. It's dumb. But yeah, thank you for tuning into my uh, rant type thing, I guess you could call it, because I want to do more videos and stuff like this. It's a lot easier for myself to cover smaller topics. I, I can't always cover massive things, so I hope you guys do enjoy this little bit of a switch up in content. Like, it'll be nice to do every once in a while. But yeah, thank you so much to my patrons this month. You guys are all so amazing, as always. And of course, this super special shout out to all of my $10 and up patrons this month. Those being Farsky, Midwest Funky, Helen, Seaman Punk, and Medusa Lives. 
You guys are the best, and your donations honestly do make so much of a difference for me being able to put out all this content and to focus on this type of stuff. So thank you so much. It really does mean the world to me. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and as always, it should be art over algorithm. Goodbye. I just can't think anymore. Bring me back what I want. Sit my ass on the floor. I just can't find me no lord. Don't feel strong where I've been. I'm blowing off in the wind. Paper the rights of my sins. I pray they stop.